Hi guys, here I am today, very excited with my first ever cohorted box. My name's Fawn and this is my channel. I try to make it a happy place. If you can hear lots of rustling, it's because my cat Ethel thinks that um, Christmas is all about her and playing with anything and everything she can pull off the tree or pull out from under the tree. <laughs> if you like that kind of thing, if you've got mad pets too, please do give me a thumbs up, click subscribe and leave me a comment. Ah, oh, bird get down. As you know, I cancelled a couple of boxes last month. Uh, one of them was Lux Diva because it was just getting too expensive and the other was Anonymous Jewellery because I have Mint Mongoose now and I've been preferring the jewellery I get from Mint Mongoose. So rather than just, you know, <laughs> have a little bit more money in the bank. I thought, what box can I get that I've always fancied? And this was one of them, cohorted. So I'm very excited because it's the first one. So I opened this box to find this box inside. I should have figured that out, shouldn't I? But anyway, look at that, isn't it nice? Mm. Love a few treats. Oh, can't get it open. So take the lid off. And inside I've got various vouchers. I will show them in case they're of any interest. A £50 wine voucher for Virgin. A £10 off my first order from Bloom and Wild. There's quite a lot in here. Um, I can claim a free gift from Cohorted. I think that must be for, for a friend. And a Mindful Chef leaflet. Finally, I'm down to the paper and the sticker. So let's go for it. Now, when I signed up, you got a free gift. And I'm hoping it's in here because I'm quite excited about it. Got a little sort of business card from Cohorted. It says, um, We hope you enjoy your beauty box, packed with love by Suzanne. So nice. And then you get a book. I love anything that gives me a book. I love the information in them. I actually sit and read them. Is that sad, ladies? But I do. I sit and read them. This one's quite interesting. It's got things like how to avoid the Christmas crash and um, sustainability and oh, it even advertises Sephora, which we don't get over here. So this must be an international box. So let's get into it, shall we? First things first is something called Argentum. I'm sure that's not how you're meant to say it. Argentum, possibly. It's a multi-award winning skincare brand that emits the timeless strength of silver, breaking gender and age boundaries to deliver unique and powerful skincare. Mmm. Argentum balances their groundbreaking science using symbolism and poetry through the messages of their 12 archetypes, delivering beauty through balance. Okay, so I have here a nourishing oil milk cleanser, La Lune de Velours. And it's a facial cleanser with silver hydrosol and DNA HP. I don't know what DNA HP is. It's got a little tag on the end here. This is so exciting. It does feel very luxurious, I must admit. It does feel very, very shishi. Oh, and you open it up and there's a pot oh and a tiny weenie there's a sponge look at this tiny weenie. and i think it's a real sponge a natural sponge which some people don't approve of because of you know the coral reefs etc but i think that's real and then this pot which is so beautiful it really is it's glass with a plastic top unscrew black lid inside See if I can pop it off. Oh, it smells lovely. That was a heck of a heave to get that off. It's a really thick, thick, thick paste. That is gorgeous. That, yeah. Oh, and it feels lovely. I'm just tapping my finger in it. Smells fabulous. Oh, they've put all sorts of um, herbs and natural oils in it and everything. That is fab. Oh, I love that. And look how she-she that is. I mean, what a gift for somebody. I'm actually keeping it for me. 
But if I was looking for a gift for somebody and I gave them that, they'd be like, wow. That is really, really beautiful. Happy with that. <laughs> I couldn't resist saying it. Oh, let's push that back together. Next is, oh, it tells you a lot more about it. So it's La Lune de Velours and the recommended retail price on this is £98 and I believe it. I believe it. Looking at how shishi this is, I believe it. And you get a whole two-page spread of what it is. They call it the Velvet Moon. It's an oil milk cleanser. Oh, this is lovely. It's got vitamins and antioxidants, non-comedogenic organic oils. You can really smell them. Effectively removes makeup and includes a fine silk sea sponge. You smooth and massage it onto dry skin, soak the natural sponge and gently massage in circular motions. Watch as it transforms into a soothing milk texture upon contact with water. <laughs> I love it. And I'm going to put how much this box was in the description because I can't remember it is more expensive than ones i normally get but it wasn't 98 pounds worth so i'm already ahead next is a pat mcgrath lipstick this oh my god this box is so good the value it says is 35 pounds i mean look at the packaging ladies can you see that it's got lips and it's glittery oh so let's just oh, pull it open Oh, and a lovely sort of a deep browny pink. It's called Flesh Fatale. Number 72, Flesh Fatale. That is beautiful. That really is beautiful. And the packaging is just to die for. And when you push that back on, it's not magnetic, but you can hear it click. So what does it say? Want the perfect pout for Christmas? The ultimate festive lipstick for you from the one and only Pat McGrath. Um, this electrifyingly elegant lipstick delivers a hot, a hot yet hi-fi glow suspended in the tantalising texture of an emollient infused formula. Don't they know how to say it though, don't they? <laughs> they can't say it's nice and soft and creamy and feels great. Um, lavish your lips in a bronzed rose lit with scintillating golden pink pearl that melts smoothly into the lips. And as I say, £35. <laughs> I'm enjoying this box. Next is Mon Pure London. It's a clarifying scalp scrub. Apparently it's a favourite, it says on here. So they must have given it away before or had it in a box before. The clarifying scalp scrub exfoliates away dead skin and debris that causes irritation with biodegradable jojoba beads. Well, that's good, biodegradable. Um... It also improves the environment for hair growth with moisturising and healing shea butter, as well as nourishing argan oil extract. The bees are non-abrasive, but sweep away debris with a plum, and that is £18. Let's have a look. Oh, it's got a, a paper lid on it, but I will take it off. Ooh, it's very, very sort of minty, and I bet that tingles like heck on your head. I like it. And I find now I'm using a lot more dry shampoos and a lot more styling products. You know, when I curl my hair, I am getting a bit of an itchy scalp. It's not dandruff as such. I think it's just the product settling on my scalp. So I might find that that is a real winner. Sorry if I moved a bit. I just had to go and rescue Ethel. She'd managed to um, tangle herself in the Christmas tree lights. My poor Christmas tree. Anyway, next up is Rodial Collagen Drops. It's um, collagen booster drops. It's a deluxe bottle, so it's 10 mils, value of 27 pounds. It says introducing Rodial's booster drops, a collection of highly concentrated single ingredient serum formulas to supercharge your skincare regime. This has a 30% collagen complex, replenishing concentrate designed to support skin renewal and target multiple signs of visible aging. That's quite a, a reasonable sized bottle, you know? And it says, gently massage two to three drops onto a cleansed face and neck. Paying particular attention to areas with expression lines. <laughs> 
it's my whole face in essence but at two to three drops that's gonna last quite a long time nice Ooh, mask monday it's a glam glow glow lace sheet mask value eight pounds it says revitalize dull tired skin with the glam glow glow lace sheet mask to create glowy radiant skin i challenge you to say that a few times over uh sheet mask is infused with hyaluronic acid along with detoxifying green tea and energizing caffeine i am always happy to try a face mask but eight pounds for a face mask i hope it isn't the holy grail because imagine using one of those every few days your bills would go up but i am excited to try it next i've got color wow color wow kale cocktail bionic tonic <laughs> kale cocktail no i can't even say it twice kale cocktail bionic tonic <laughs> they're all tongue twisters today and this is valued at 23 pounds it's a nice size bottle i mean it's um what are we looking at 200 mils so it's a good size bottle it's a heat activated hair treatment infused with sulfur rich sea kale that works to restore the hair's key internal bonds happy strengthening hair and reducing breakage by over 50 percent in just one use well i get a lot of breakage because my hair is fine and of course curly most of the time so it really does tangle in the brush so that is really good so it says on towel dried hair shake bottle well then dispense one to three pumps through your hair concentrating on breakage zones do not rinse out style with heat to activate these are all such great things and not things i've had before totally looking forward to trying that but i have to have a sniff of this what did we say it was kale it smells okay it does ha it does have a green smell it also has a sort of a hairdressery smell <laughs> but delighted to try that they've included a lint lindor mint bar now if you know me you know that at this time of the year mint chocolate is my absolute favorite i mean i like it most of the year but at christmas and look at that doesn't that look lovely and what does it say it's the purest lint chocolate with an irresistibly smooth mint flavored melting filling mm, yum, 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 yum. do i keep it do i save it do i eat it right now <laughs> it's a bit early yet really to be eating this but i don't think it'll make it past tonight and the last thing in the box i do have the free gift which i'll show you in a second but the last thing that went to everybody in this box is by floral street dark mini discovery fragrance set recommended retail price 18 pounds now it says it's a mini scent wardrobe containing a 1.5 mil sample sized spray bottle of five vegan sustainable and unforgettable perfumes you know i like little sample perfumes i'm just not well enough behaved to stick to just one big one so it has in it wild vanilla orchid <laughs> iris goddess shipra sublime black lotus and ylang ylang espresso oh i think i've got to try black lotus I really think I have so I'm just gonna so you can see that the little bottles weeny weeny little bottles let's just oh oh girls oh that smells like um that's got an undertone like a burnt fire you know when you go near um someone's had a bonfire and it's and it's gone cold like a burnt wood smell as well as the flowers that's the, the base i'm picking up i think but that is really nice so that one was called black lotus um one two three four so five little little perfumes oh, 
always happy with perfumes. I love squirting on a bit of something and depending on my mood, depends on how light or strong I want it. So it says it's award-winning vegan, vegan? Award-winning vegan fragrances. Um, and if you want to go and buy some, you get a 10% off code. There's lots actually of, of uh, tokens in here, like this one, Mirabu, which I don't know. But again, if you use the cohorted code, you get 10% off. And then my free gift was a Mar Marc Jacobs eye pencil. Now, I mean, it's not the full size. It's like a half size, but I'm still chuffed because I've been eyeing up the Marc Jacobs pencils. Um, quite fancying one but they are expensive and I wasn't sure that I liked them enough to use them now I'm trying to work it and I'm not doing very well because I've opened it can you see there's like no oh <gasps> I made it fall out there's the pencil bit the you know the actual bit that you put on your eyes Oh my goodness, how did I manage to do that? Oh, go back in. Hang on. <laughs> I'm screwing like mad to try and put it back in. Isn't that odd? It must have been stuck in the lid. So there it is there. And it's um black, I think. Let me put my glasses on. I'm not doing very well, am I? Mark Jacobs, yes, it's black. I've heard that these things stay on and stay on and stay on. But of course they're expensive, so I haven't bought any because, well, they may not be any better than anything else. But I had it as a free gift, so I was happy to try it. And yeah, I think it was stuck up in the lid. And that's why I was getting nothing. So that um, screws up and you just have the, I was gonna say lead, but it's not lead. You know what I mean, the middle bit that goes up. So that was it. So to recap, get down Bert. The booklet that has loads and loads of discount codes in it for products. My free gift. The Floral Street perfumes, which I think I'll love, although I'm really not keen on this um, Black Lotus one. That woodsy smell is a bit too strong for me. As I say, it's like burnt wood, but I'm sure some of the others will be amazing because just sniffing along the box, oh, there's some amazing smells in it. My chocky. A Glam Glow face mask. Oops, I don't know if I'm going to fit it all in tidily now. The Wow Hair, which I'm really excited to try. Ooh. The Rodial. The Scalp Mask. This gorgeous lipstick. And that facial cleanser. Look at all that in the box. I mean, it is packed, it is heavy, and these are really, really top quality products. Now, I know, as I say, that this subscription isn't the cheapest. Um, I will look into it, I will put it in the bottom. But because I'd got rid of some of the others, I felt it was worthwhile. And yeah, now I've got it, I know it's worthwhile. <laughs> I'd give up other boxes for this one, I tell you. So that was it. That was my first ever cohorted, the Christmas edition, which maybe means it's the best one because it's Christmas and I'll be disappointed later in the year. But we'll see. I'll put the details below and I'll even try and list some of the products that I got as well. Okay, take care everybody. Bye.